But when you first meet somebody, you have sex all the time, especially in the mornings, to prove the passion, the animalism, the magnetism, the physiology, the physiognomy, the sure beauty of sex. You have to wake up and have sex straight away. I could fart for Britain of a morning. <laughs> I am at my most gaseous, <laughs> incendiary, explosive. <laughs> but you've got to hold it in. <laughs> so me, the same as everybody else, you have the sex fart quandary. <laughs> We've all been there, my fine friends. When you're a bloke in the mornings, you wake up, wildebeest, sorry, still dreaming. <laughs> I wondered why there was a chest of drawers in the Serengeti. And then you look down and check out the old chap, and there he is looking up at you, you go... Well done, my son. Twelve pints last night, and you're still standing to attention. I think you've got an independent blood supply. Oh, hold on, I can't feel my feet. Oh, well, I won't be needing them. So you start having sex thinking, fantastic, she's still here. And of course she is, it's her flat. <laughs> Imagine being so bad in bed that somebody leaves their own flat. <laughs> How bad would you actually have to be? You wake up and there's a for sale sign outside, all the furniture's gone. <laughs> so anyway, so it's going quite well, like this. You can use this technique, it's minimalist but effective. <laughs> it's just called Fat Boy Waiting for the Football. <laughs> and then you get the cramp and you think, oh my God. I'm dying to fart. <laughs> this one's massive as well, this one. <laughs> I wish me mates were here for this one. <laughs> There's no one to high five. <laughs> and it wouldn't be fair just to slap her on the back, really, would it? <laughs> By the way, nice tattoo. <laughs> I love butterflies with stretch marks. <laughs> just going quite well. What's it look like? Fat butterfly. <laughs> it's not going to take off. So it's going quite well. Howard Hughes couldn't make that fly. <laughs> so and then the cramp is getting worse, and you're thinking, oh, this is terrible. Clinch, thrust, clinch, thrust, clinch, thrust, clinch, thrust, clinch, thrust, clinch, clinch. That was close. Thrust, <laughs> clinch, thrust, clinch. I wish I'd had a piss as well before I started. <laughs> You don't see this in the porn films, do you? And I'm not going to try and disguise it with a cough, either. No, 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 no. Last time I did that, I was cleaning shit off the wall for two days. It's a Jackson Pollock scratch and sniff. Trust. You see it lying there going, ah, ooh, ah, ooh. And she's thinking, he's loving this. Look at his face. He's loving it. You go, uh, 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 uh. And she's lying there going, ah, ooh, ah. And you're thinking, she's loving this. And she's thinking, I'm dying to have a fart. <laughs> I wish this fat bloke could hurry up. <laughs> he keeps on pressing on me bladder. I wish I'd had a piss before I started. And his breath stinks. <laughs> How did he get lettuce in his nose? <laughs> he's picked his nose in abracababra. That's what he's done. <laughs> he's a disgrace. Go on, get off. <laughs> All right, but I'll be back in a minute, you lucky woman. <laughs> Into the toilet. <laughs> oh my God. I think I've just released Deirdre Rashid. <laughs> and at this point, I look down and think what every man has thought at least once. I think, well, that's the fart sorted out. <laughs> but how am I going to piss with this? <laughs> and it's harder than it's ever been. It's, it's like titanium. It's like tempered steel. Just go down for one minute. Just go down for one minute. Camilla, Camilla, Camilla. <laughs> Camilla, Camilla, Camilla. So at this point, my friends, you are standing in her hallway with an erection. Her dog is licking the sweat off your ass. And you're thinking, hmm, strangely pleasurable. It's nice to meet a fellow Mason. 
she's got a dog, it must be quite a large flat. <laughs> so all I'm saying to you before I depart this mortal coil into obscurity from whence I arrived is basically fart in front of your partner. So I thought, well, next time I see her, I'll fart out loud, get it over and done with. And I did, and she was okay about it, really, you know. I mean, her dad was pissed off. <laughs> the rest of the congregation could have taken it better. <laughs> There'll be other funerals, you know. I shouldn't have lit it, maybe, but it's difficult to know, isn't it? You've been great. God bless. Thank you. Good night.